Have you ever been tasked with forecasting your company's revenue? Or determining how much inventory to stock based on forecast of demand? There are two main use cases in business forecasting, demand and growth. We see examples of demand forecasting in business operations and in treasury departments to more accurately plan inventory, products, and services. Growth forecasts help to anticipate revenue growth, expenses, and cash flows. They're commonly useful to finance teams and more recently to FinOps teams. When tasked with forecasting, you might have relied on your experience to make an educated guess or have a team of analysts take a few weeks to build a forecast. However, you probably want to use machine learning for it. Machine learning provides the ability to achieve the most important goal of any forecast, accuracy. At Anadot, we built a machine learning-based forecasting system for time series data. The system automatically produces accurate forecasts for any scenario without requiring any machine learning knowledge. But what were the main challenges we had to overcome to create an accurate forecasting system? We found that there are three areas that play the biggest role in building a highly accurate forecast. First is identifying influencing events and metrics. What are they and why are they important? Let's look at an example of an influencing event. Suppose you're an e-commerce company forecasting revenue and you plan on having a big sale on March 2nd. If you based your forecast only on historical data without accounting for the sales event, your forecasted revenue would be much lower than your actual sales. By integrating data from your previous sale events, your model can more accurately predict what your revenue will be during the March sale. What about an influencing metric? Suppose you're a gaming company that wants to forecast revenue for the next month. Number of recent app downloads is a leading indicator of future revenues, since new users will start generating revenue gradually as they use the game more and more. So how do you use machine learning to automatically identify those influencing events and metrics for your forecast? Here is a simple procedure that we use at Anadot. The product computes the shifted correlations between the target metric, the revenue in the gaming example, and all other metrics and events across the business. Doing it efficiently across billions of metrics is part of Anadot's secret sauce. The second consideration is to account for data anomalies. If you don't consider anomalies during training, you end up with models that aren't accurate for forecasting for other periods of time. Models will learn the anomaly and then try to factor that outlying data in their forecast, leading to poor forecasts. You can test this out for yourself on Excel. Create a regression model with a strong linear relationship and just add a couple of outliers and you'll see that they skew the results completely, pulling your model away from the actual direction of the data samples. The trick to not letting anomalies skew your forecast is to discover them before training and then create new features that deal with them based on their relevance. We have two types depending on whether the anomaly can be explained. If the anomaly can be explained by some external factor, either another measure or event, then you should enhance or boost the anomaly in your training data. If the anomaly cannot be explained, then you can weigh down the anomaly. In our experience, these improve accuracy by up to 15%. The third element in improving accuracy of forecasts involves the models you decide to use. A lot of different algorithms were designed for time series forecasting, and there isn't one that rules them all. Each model has its own mathematical way of describing data, like an expert in their field. Ensembling these models together is the best way to get the most accurate model. It's like taking advice from numerous experts, weighing the value of each to build the strongest forecast. So, to conclude, an ML-based forecasting system has many benefits, most importantly, accuracy. Ensuring that you get the best forecast depends on three factors. Identifying influencing metrics and events, which requires efficient feature selection. Accounting for data anomalies, you'll need to pre-process before training to boost accuracy. And building an ensemble of models. For more on creating an ML-based forecasting system, read our three-part guide at anadot.com. Thank you.